Well, working on this unit can be a little, a little fearful at first, um, just because of the fear of getting COVID, but that's kind of why Spectrum's prepared with all of our different positions. They have the hot zone bosses, making sure people are going in and out of the room safely. They have the nurses caring for the patients. Um, so I feel, I feel good about it now. I feel like we're well prepared. We're, it's, it's hard coming to work knowing that you are um, facing positive patients and that you could potentially be putting yourself and your family members and friends at risk. Um, but at the same time, I've heard, you know, people are excited to be here to help make a difference and really take care of our patients and know that we are helping them on their way to recovery. So it, overall, it truly is a good feeling knowing that we're on the front lines making a difference. And, um, I came to know that I'm working on this nine center, which is a COVID floor in this season. Uh, the day before my work starts, initially I was uh, a little bit scary as I have a uh, four-year-old son and uh, seven-year-old daughter at home. But I'm glad that I'm able to, you know, help the patients in need, and uh, I'm glad that I'm in a right, you know, you know, health system who have good support staff. It's actually kind of hard to remember what working before COVID really was. Um, um, some of my friends and family probably would not agree so much, but it's kind of interesting to be a part of like a global pandemic because we'll hopefully never see something like this again. So it's very interesting to see like the Spectrum team as a whole in Nine Center kind of come together and really encourage each other and work together and motivate each other to kind of push through this. Yeah, every day is different. We don't know what we're going to expect and sometimes it can be scary. Some days you cry, some days you laugh. It's, it's more than just helping people, it's being with them, especially during this time where visitors aren't allowed. Sometimes just simply shaving a patient, holding their hand, and just being there, being their hope, being their light. You know, it's been a whole mix of emotions. It, there are times where you feel overwhelmed, there are times you feel scared, but a lot of the times it's also kind of inspiring to be here and work with this team. A lot of these patients are more scared than they've ever been. And it's good to know that I can come in there and not really give them a right smile because I have a mask, but at least brighten up their day somehow. Like, I, I shaved someone the other day and they cried because it was like the first time they felt human and we are human, we are supposed to be together during these times and yeah, it's just being there for each other. It means so much to us to see these patients recover enough to be able to go home or to uh, rehab to further their recovery. Um, we definitely love what we do here.